What up everybody, it's Dan and we're back here with another review and this is something new but old. Now, I previously did a review on my Dream Sequence Michael Myers once custom figure and that was the old formula. Now this is the brand new formula. Bigger body, different style of coveralls, new material. Goddamn boys, if you guys see how tall this bitch is, look at that. Goddamn look at that. I just want to do a quick review on this guy because I did one on my old piece, but let's start from the bottom up. It's got the concrete base. It's got a hobo knife in there. A nice Rob Zombie H1 knife. Boots, nicely weathered. Coveralls, beautiful. To perfection. Got the right pockets. And don't say that the patches are missing because in the sequel it had no patches on the chest. Or I just want to clarify that. Not one spot of detail is missing look at that blood work that head sculpt guys this piece is super super imposing grimy as fuck this is one's customs fucking one of his bread and butters accessory head sculpt when he cuts the guy's head off in the van when they hit the cow and this is a 2018 piece but this is the formula he's using now now he just released a rob zombie h1 run 15 pieces were sent out to those lucky few, and I gotta tell you, I'm very jealous. But, um, damn, this would pair up perfectly with that. Got the glass shard as well. But until next time, y'all, hit us up if you want Once Customs to make you a piece like this. Or if you don't know how to get in contact with them, message me here. Message Paul Manzi, Rob Terrell on our Facebook or IGs. And we will take care of you and answer any questions. Uh, I know it's kind of hard for when a new person gets in a hobby. But we will answer any questions to the best of our capabilities. And until next time, y'all, stay sick. Peace.